Hello everyone. I have been feeling very triggered lately with all the shit on the internet of making fun of me, other feminists, and I feel that people are body shaming a lot of us by calling us fat asses, land whales, Amy Schumer fans. And I want to show you heteronormative cisgenders just on how wrong all of you are. The best diet to have has to be all natural. Because I'm vegan, I don't believe in using any animal products. So instead, I just make all of my foods by myself. As an example, I use my yeast infections to make my bread and I make my own mayonnaise. Now a lot of people say that mayonnaise is made from eggs, but I don't use those kinds of eggs because that is just murder. And if you are one of those meat eaters, then get the hell out of this channel because you're just a fucking terrorist. I'm feeling a little triggered. But, instead, I go to Sweden and meet a whole group of Arabic men and they help me get fertilized eggs. And with those fertilized eggs, I take a few pills to get the eggs out and I use that to make mayonnaise. I know a lot of people say that my methods are very inefficient, but I can prove you wrong though. I think we need to allow more refugees into this country so that we can have a greater amount of fertilized eggs. But the conservatives keep on trying to block it. Those fucking racists. A lot of people say that feminists would lose if a civil war occurred. But what they don't think about is how great cardio that all feminists have. If you don't believe me, then watch this. See? Now, <laughs> I think that out of any workouts, Feminists clearly outtake any other group when it comes to strength training. And I'll show you. Now, before I work out, I like to have a little bit of motivation. You seem uh, objectively prettier than I am. Your voice is higher pitched than mine is. Is there evidence that gender is a social construct? No. In fact, I think there's evidence that it is not a social construct. That